Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued blind let's play Legend of Dragoon for PlayStation. My name is the Flightless Bird, this is your story based gaming channel, and today we've already made it through the volcano, we went through the barrage, we also defeated the firebird, and now what's left is to go after the dragon itself. Oh boy, let's do this. I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. So go ahead and get started here. There's a box on the opposite side of this river. We gotta come back around for it. Let's make a mental note to do that. I, I try to go to see if I could cross the vines to go down and it slingshot me to the left. Guys, do you feel something? Well, we are in the dragon's nest. This forest is contaminated by the dragon's po- Oh, <clears throat> This forest is contaminated by the dragon's poison. I just got the feeling like Shana would say something like that, like she has a sixth sense towards it. I see. That's why this indoors doesn't have defense in this forest. I hope we're not always poisoned. That would suck. A normal person cannot be exposed to this poison for a long time. It's a natural defense. Oh my! What's wrong? I felt a little bit dizzy, that's all. I guess it is hard for a woman. Wow, jeez, dude. Oh, I am a woman too. Yeah, exactly. Well, you are special. Special, huh? Well, fine. I don't capitalize on a woman's frailty anyway. I don't mean to do- oh no. I'm okay. See? Rose is fine too. But I- I'm sorry. I need to go rest a little. Shauna! Why are you just running off in this forest, girl? Come on. When the dragon's nest, it's just like, I'm gonna go run off of the forest. I'll be fine. Heck is that? Are you alright? Uh-huh. Don't worry, I don't feel sick anymore. Besides, I think I got used to the air in this place. Well, then, can you go with us? Sure. If I fall down here, there would be no meaning to me coming with you. Indeed, we could say the war is in our hands because the Kaisers cannot make a move. Shana, please don't leave us like that. We don't know what awaits us. Sorry. Now, let's move on. They are plain brother and sister. Yep, they are always like that. Which probably drives Shana absolutely insane. Okay, before we do anything, I need to write down EXP tools to see if I can figure out how the EXP works. Okay, let's go ahead and get in our first fight. What do we got in the dragon's nest? It is full of swampy, poisonous. Whoa, what the heck are those? The, the enemy designs this game are just wild. Run fast. His name is Run Fast. And a mandrake. <laughs> well, I ever get used to that time differential. Oh my gosh, Dart is like really hurt. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. Burning rush. Try to take care of that guy first. He is called Run Fast, so I don't want to run away. Try to need some heals or some blocks. One of the two. Mm. Ha, da, da. 
I knew it. I knew it as soon as I did it. I was like, dang it, too fast. Okay, so we got 31 total EXP. And Dart went from 1443 to 1453. So that's a plus 10. Uh, Lavitz went from 1395 to 1405. So that's also a plus 10. Rose went from 1523 to 1533. That's also a plus 10. Shana was at 781. So the question is, how much of that experience did Shauna get? Did she just get the one? Or did she get five? See, I, I'm thinking she got five. And if she got five, she would be at 786. That's it. So the, the, the AX split is split in third for your three active party members. And then whatever your active party members get, it's then split in half for your backup units. Now, I don't know if that's going to be true once we get more backup units, but at the moment, at least, uh, Shauna only got five EXP. I <clears throat> probably will use a healing pot here. He is way too hurt for me to just like shield up nonstop. Not really sure the best way to go here, as always. Oh, crud. Wow! Well, that sucked. Probably should have explored the other way first. I knew it as soon as I stepped on that spider web. It's probably a bad idea. Good, you've come around. Yes, I think I'm fine. I got to portray her so weak. Where are we? Although that could be great character evolution, like she gets stronger throughout the game. And the nest of the dragon. Well, at least we don't need to look for a fair brand anymore. What confidence you have. Is that because you are a dragon? I guess. I think it was always like this. Guys, look at this. There is still pure water left of this horse. Oh, I didn't even need to use that healing potion, did I? At least the entire horse is not spoiled. Let's go. If we defeat the monster, the force will be spared. Or saved. Yeah, I, I wish it healing pop. But that's okay. It's not like the rest of the people in my party didn't benefit from the healing spring. What a spooky plant. And also, now that we're in the Lair Dragon, I miss everything that's on the uh, forest area as well. Which I'm not really happy about. We have another teleport section. I'm sure, I'll have a chance to probably explore later. Alright, same fight as before. This time we're fully charged though. Probably should kill the mandrakes first. Like, kill anything that could possibly poison. That does a lot of damage, Shauna. I'm gonna have you hit the run fast. I, I have no words. Yes. I'm like, I'm gonna have him hit the run fast because he's gonna do the most damage because of his multiple combos. And then I just do absolutely nothing with it. Oh, the run away does, the run fast does run away. Okay, I thought it might. I mean, based on a name like run fast, you think it's probably gonna run away. So I should definitely prioritize this guy's more. Are we here? We can do. Was that the best way to go? I mean, there was another alternate way we could have gone. Oh, okay, cool. 
That was the right way to go. We got a bravery amulet. Let us see what a bravery amulet does. Avoids the abnormal status fear. Well, we are gonna fight a dragon, so that may be important. What's going on? Oh, I got it. When it is touched, it reacts with that. Okay, so we gotta clear a path there. So up and around here. Then back. And then left. My pure fire. Oh, new enemy. What do we got? Man, I mean, designs this game are just wild. Lizard Man. Let's go to the Mandrake. Whip smack. Ah, that's a lot of damage. Why can't I get his combo working today? Like, I I am constantly missing his combos. And wow, that guy didn't seem to have a lot of HP. I mean, 35 damage killed him after a failed combo from Lavitz. That's not a lot at all. I saw myself here, but... There's only one way to go here. And there's only one way to go here. And that's down here. Okay, what did I miss? something somewhere <laughs> I am so directionally challenged I swear let's go <laughs> man I hate that so much Like, as complicated as the combos are in this game, did they really think they needed to have a counter system? Ah, oh, and it ran away because we failed the combo. And because I did not execute properly, I just got iced out. Oh my god! That's a lot of damage, game! And it's using it back to back? What the heck, game? Dude, that is not cool. And I missed the combo. That was not cool at all. Enemies should not be able to do an AoE that takes off like a third of your health. Back to back, no less. So I'm missing something obvious, I don't know what it is. So now we're back down here. There's not there's no there's nothing down there. And there's nothing over here. I mean that that's that's like a teleporter. I can't 
Why am I so bad with directions? Takes me out there. Takes me out there. And that takes me to a chest. Okay, new strategy. Don't care about the runaway enemy. It would be nice if we could take him out, but take out this stupid mandrake who can nuke my entire party for massive amounts of damage. Well, I actually didn't kill it. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna game over do this stupid plant. That's way too powerful. Well, at least I finally did that on him. Now he runs away. Yep, yeah, uh, saw that coming. When you get like very little experience for random encounters, and the enemies just do ridiculous amount of damage there. See, that takes me up there. So what the heck am I missing here? It may not be a bad idea to go back to the start. Just to heal myself after getting nuked three times. By that stupid plant. All right, I'm obviously missing something somewhere. Maybe you could climb up to the right there instead of going in the cave. That is a possibility. So down here, you see how there's one of those things going up right here? Ha, ah, that was it, that was it. I'm telling you, I miss really easy things like that. Hey, we got new enemies. I'm so glad to get rid of those stupid cost enemies. Tricky bats. <laughs> I'm not off to a good start today, that is for sure. Get, uh, fall into a spider web, get lost in a chasm. Miss multiple additions. Just flat out miss. <laughs> Thank you all for putting up with me. How did that work? Like, I'm pretty sure I'm doing that at the right time. I just completely whiffed. And as I said, you know, it's not like you get a lot of experience from random encounters, so... The grinding is more probably for additions than anything else. Spirit Potion. So I opened the main path. Want to go down here first, though? Hoping for some equipment. We keep getting items. Okay, now we need to look back around. And we actually need to do it this time instead of just being totally lost in a maze. Hopefully, if I didn't detect that sooner. I just saw the cave, so I'm like, oh, you gotta go through the cave. Didn't realize there was another passage right to the right of that. That is a lot. Now, one of the ways I'm not too... Well, we're about to go to a rest point, too. I mean, that's a lizard man. It's not one of those mandrakes, so it's okay. What the heck happened? 
What happened there? That was weird. Yes. All these misses are killing me. You did do better, flightless bird. laid on it I cannot get this burning rush down I just am struggling with it not the burning rush uh, the uh, spinning cane whatever y'all know what I meant Jump down here. Go ahead and use a restore. And then we can easily continue on. Right through here. If I don't go out of control on the map. Save point, pause up ahead, most likely. Although I still wanted to explore the rest of that area. Uh, this Rotate them saves. Now I usually rotate like once every episode. Who is this? It's not a dragon. Is that two Levitts? It's so ironic to find the adventure in here. Who the heck is this? You are Graham. Do you know him? I will never forget Tim. He used to be the head of the second knighthood of Basil. Graham. Yeah, I'm just gonna say Graham because his name is spelled differently than I'm used to. The man who used to be my father's best friend, or best man. Same thing. Welcome, Lavitz. You have become a knight, fulfilling the wishes of your late father, Servi. Oh, that's Graham, not Lavitz. But anyway, uh, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be an enemy because I don't think the game would give us two polar musers. Yeah. Don't you ever mention my father's name. Are you still carrying that grudge after more than a dozen years from my betrayal of your father? Yeah! That's not all. You betrayed King Albert. You betrayed every single person I know. Is that the wrath of a patriotic knight or a man full of vengeance? Both. Graham, now I get to avenge my father who trusted you and died in vain. I was about to say, I'm pretty sure that we've heard this guy before. Get revenge, huh? Try. See if you can truly best me in my newly obtained power. Emerge the power of the dragon. Okay, I'm gonna make a little prediction here and say that we're gonna fight him and Lavitz is gonna get that power. You, you are a dragoon. It shouldn't be a surprise. Only the dragons can manipulate dragons. Behind the dragon, there should be- Oh, he's controlling the dragon. Oh. Oh, oh this is bad. This is really bad. This is the power I obtained. Obtaining that power is not an easy matter. You, where did you get the dragoon spirit? I'm amazed there is someone in Basil who knows about this. Fine, you too will know before you die. His Majesty Dole got all his power and intelligence from Emperor Diaz. So is a Majesty and an Emperor? Like, are, are they... Are they working for each other? Working with each other? Allies? Is this some kind of dream? Emperor Diaz died 11,000 years ago. 
With the name of the Holy Imperial Brilliano. Okay, well, that explains that. If this is a dream, how can I... How can you explain what you're about to see? Come, I give you a chance to avenge your father. He had the courage to fight against legendary Dragoon. So, he got the power from a guy who died 11,000 years ago. Did this guy actually die? Did we see the body? Is it confirmed? Oh boy, so we are fighting against both the dragon and the dragon. How do we want to approach this? I think I want to save Rose's transformation for heals. And I think I want to go out to Graham first. Okay, that's manageable. That's not manageable. I just got a feeling killing the Dragoon is going to be faster than killing the Dragon. We do have explosion magic though. But it's only 25% and I'd much rather focus fire to take this guy out as soon as possible. Let's see if I can do this. I think I missed that last one again. The last one's so hard to do. Pretty sure it's like frame perfect or something. Like 39 damage. Yeah! Now's the time to come in clutch with those. Oh, he missed! Well, that's, that's, that's really nice of him. He's still in blue health, though. Which means he probably has, like, I don't know what, like 500, 600 HP. I don't know. I was going to say, I don't know what that is, but now I know what it is. AOE attack. And it did hurt a little. Is now the time to heal? Probably. And he's poisoned. Great. I don't know how to hit that fifth one. I don't know what I'm doing wrong with it. Okay, Lavis' turn is going to be used to heal poison. Body purify, I believe. Yes. And Rose's turn is going to be used to heal. I mean, heal only heals about 23. So doing it once we all have lost some hit points uh, makes a whole lot of sense to me. Single target, we'll target Graham. I thought that was an all target. Would be nice to drain everyone, but ow well. I really like this ability. It's nice to have a heal on the team in some way, even if it's just minimal. Oh, I healed 31. That's pretty good. And 94 damage, too. And considering he's in doing AoE on me, that's going to take... Oh, that's not AoE. That's a single target. Okay, 49. That's a little bit more dangerous. Uh, let's see. What am I going to do? Uh, attack? Burning rush. Uh, 
Lavitz is really hurt. I could do another AoE heal, or uh, not AoE heal, but single target heal. Not only that, but does a tremendous amount of damage. Alive? Can't have much left. Ugh, I got a deep gash. Okay, he's gone. Alright, one last thing to worry about. Uh, live with some heavy block because your HP is really low. That's a good idea. Uh, dart, press the attack. Rose is also going to press her attack. Lyrits, so you're going to guard again. Rose is going to get splattered. Resisted the poison, though. That's huge. Good, 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 good. Uh, continue the attack. Good day blocked. Press on. Yes. Burning rush. Continue to defend. Should not be missing those. Heck was a blue one do. Ah, fear, okay. We kind of wondered if that was going to be a thing because we did find that fear bracelet. But it's easily cured. Way too early. I pressed that like a full second too early. I, w I don't know why I pressed it too early, but man, I got, I got nervous there. Should I throw a healing pot on him? Good. I'm also gonna take this opportunity to throw another heal. Yeah, she loses some SP because of this, but. But the idea here is we should be able to kill the dragon before she refills on that second bar. Especially if we do something like this, because this will do like, you know, 90 damage. Ah, I did 118 with a massive amount of regen. Or healing. It seems like the uh, it's a life steal. The more we train, the more we heal. Attack power up, which totally makes sense. He's almost down, so I could defend to try to save him, but I don't think he's gonna do 150 damage to us. And if we can just take him out, we don't need to worry about it. First dragon down. Wow, that's a lot of EXP. Yeah, even Shauna leveled up from that. No new additions though. You have Surrey strength. My efforts were to no avail. I even used betrayal to obtain this power. I still don't understand. Why did you betray my father? You were not like this. Nobody could be stronger than your father. That was the only thing I could never conquer. 
I had admiration for him as a mate and as a friend. But time goes by and it turned into this feeling. This, this fear from realizing the limits of your ability. This fear that goes nowhere. The only thing you can do is curse yourself for weakness. But you couldn't overcome your fear by deflecting to Dole. You need to overcome my father. There was an alternative. I could only I could attain a new power I could be equal to or surpass him. That was the dragoon spirit I got from His Majesty Dole. Lavitz, live strong. Now I can go to be with Servi. He is lucky to be dead now. Greed for power eventually conquers you. Unleash power generates only sorrow. You should have known that. You were lucky to die now and avoid even more sorrow. Well, what is this? Such a coincidence? It can't be. Or is this fate? Lavitz, maybe you two are. That is right. The dragon spirit of the Jade Dragon recognized you as the next master. Yep, call that one. I am a dragoon. I deserve to rule dragons. Not only do you deserve, but you have an obligation to accept your fate as a dragoon. Don't you? It's what Graham left for me. I understand. I accept it. The fate of a dragoon. I will use this power for justice. Like dirt in rose. Use for justice. Huh. By the dragoon spirit of the Jade Dragon. Jade? Jade Dragon. Good for you, Lavitz. Ah! Uh, Shauna? I can't breathe. Too much poison? We cannot make it over Villiard carrying Shauna. Then we had to go to Lohan. Lohan? That commercial town? Yes, that's it. I heard there was a great doctor there. Hurry. So am I going to miss that entire forest area? Check this. I said I should probably check the sides and I ended up climbing out of this thing. Well, I guess there's probably nothing on the sides then. Oh, it looks like I can cross over here. Okay, I can't cross over here. Yeah, there's nothing over here to the right or left. I mean, the fact that that exclamation mark appears almost immediately kind of does say that. Now, the only problem, though, th with this is, um... I don't know if I can explore the other side of the forest now. Because there does seem to be a way to cross back left. Crosscut uh, to Bale area. Right, Dragon Sam, beware slides. Ah, I can jump down here. Oh, wait, wait. I want to go all the way down first, though. Remember, there's a treasure chest all the way down here? I wonder if I could have just skipped the dragon and gone directly to the next area. I wonder if I can even go back the other way, or do I have to go all the way back to the dragon's den? And there's these stupid things that AoE me, and I'm not fully healed. Definitely not. <laughs> Eat that 
so much. It's hard enough to do the addition as is. But when you throw a delay in there. I should probably look at my addition, see what levels they are and everything. I don't think I'm at 80 yet with anyone. Probably at, I don't know, 35, 40 with Frozen Dart. And then like 10 with Labbits. Uh, 47? Pretty close. 14? Also pretty close to what I said. Uh, 52? Much higher than what I thought. Although she doesn't have any other addition right now, so it doesn't matter with her. Wow, that battle came quick. Take out the Mandrake. Wow, 106 damage. Dang. I can already see a major flaw with this game that I'm going to hate later. I mean, when I get an addition that has like, I don't know, four attacks on dart and that keeps happening. Or if there's addition with even more four attacks and it's like, attack, counter, attack, counter, attack. It's going to be just so frustrating to do. Fire chainmail. Much better defense for Dart. Yeah, it's like plus 12. Let's go up. And before I jump across this. That looks like a good guy to go back through that. Now, the question is, was there anything on the other side there? Was that the way to Lohan? I kind of wanted to jump down just for the heal, but then I had to climb all the way back up and then go all the way back around. And I just completely whiffed that. one thing too is if Rose maxes her addition that means I could probably put Shauna in for Rose try to get EXP I just hope this isn't the right way to go that happens sometimes. You accidentally bumble onto progress when you don't mean to. Nice. Of course, picking on the one with the lowest HP. One shot the entire party. Not bad. There's this giant plant here. The plant is blocking the way. We cannot go farther unless we do something about it. Really? Seriously? You gotta be kidding me. All right, well, let me go all the way back up and uh, through the dragon. Uh, I'll see you guys in a second. All right, we're back up here. 
uh, just fought. It was like one battle, a couple runaways, another enemy, uh, the the mummy like guy. Oh wow, this was. Nope. Okay, I was I was about to say this is a shortcut back to the uh, town. No, this is the runaway to Lohan. Uh, we did meet that guy who said he was going this way, right? What's his name? Uh, I don't know. I think I went down in the uh, last video as a chapter. Dabas. Right. Dabas. The boss. He's the boss. <laughs> Oops. Uh, the commercial town of Lohan. Let's go. Carrying her in here. Almost got run over by whatever that thing is. What a crowd, and we're in the middle of a war. It's true. If I were fine, it would be fun. You'll get well soon. I couldn't believe it was dragon's poison until I saw it with my own eyes. I have never seen such symptoms. There is nothing wrong with the body, at least that's how it seems, but her consciousness has closed inward after she arrived here. It seems the mind is poisoned, not the body. I don't think the clinic can help her. I'm sorry, but in this condition, it could be a week if she is lucky. What? A week? Can't you do something? I'll do everything I can. Oh, uh, was such a cute girl doing with the legendary monster? She fought against it to save the country. Think hard. Is there anything you can do? Hold on. If we can get some Chagoni plant, she may survive. Really? I read it in a secret Ellen book. The problem is, as with dragons, Chagoni plant exists only in legend. I cannot say for sure it really exists. Is it a plant that's blocking away? Even so, we cannot wait like this, doing nothing. Let's go look for Dragoni plant on our own. At least we may be able to find something in this town. Lohan is a commercial town where everybody is welcome. There should be some information here. Although it is temporary, I'll try to stitch the poisoning. I'm not called the best doctor in Sergio for nothing. I will rise to the occasion. God, his name is Senator, though. Like, when you hear that name, you think of a title. Whoa, this clinic is huge. You'd like to be treated? It costs 20. Um, no, I'm fine. I'm not poisoned. Came back here looking for Stardust. How are you doing? Have you found any Dragoni plant yet? Oh! So the clinic is this one room. There's multiple, like, areas built on top of this one building. Yeah, look at this place. Wild. Why does this room exist if there's nothing in it? Just to try you crazy? At least there's an exit to the left. Yeah, I'm just gonna take all your stuff. Take your life savings right from under your nose. I lost my son, he was wandering around by himself. I told him so many times not to wait, I can't believe it. The girl across the street seems to be interested in me. I am such a simple guy making some unknown lady fall in love with me. Looking at the guy across the street makes me feel at ease. The reason I feel that way is... Because the guy across the street looks like the dog I used to... Wow! Jeez! 
really messed up. The town is a little too big for the old people. Please, uh, people should be more considerate. Have a drink, but don't get foolish. Don't drink under 21, it's common sense. Not found any Stardust yet. I've been clicking on everything. Wow, that's cool. So I came in that way. Don't run on the roof. <laughs> Look at this guy so angry at me. I'm trying to get off it, all right? Guy, give me a second. Can you walk in this game? I don't see. I don't see a way to walk. I asked my dad to take care of the store. I'm gonna go look at the arena. The solar economy is only in your mind. If you make whoopee, the solar economy will move on to someplace else. Okay. Uh, if you make whoopee. Yeah, guy just said that. <laughs> what? Come on, the globe should have had something. Hey brother, how about this pendant for you, sweetheart? I haven't found anything in this town just yet, except a couple items. What angel rope? Get your anything that's in equipment for Shauna. Who is not in my party? Sure, game. Thanks. Give me an item for someone who just left my party. This game is cool. It's that guy. The boss. Welcome. Hey, the boss. It's a goofy. It's a goofy merchant from the other day. I'm glad you folks are here. Thanks for really, really. Now I can run my business. So what do you want? You can find anything in the boss's antiques. Do you carry herbs too? You got it! I have everything from extremely rare medicine to secret magical medicine. Have you heard of the Dragoni plant? I heard it's a very rare herb. Oh, the Dragoni plant. You have it? No! <laughs> the ball! I need that! Oh no, don't get mad. I was just kidding, but let me think harder. I remember hearing about it somewhere. Hold on a sec. Well, in the secret notebook, yes, it's in here. It says, north of the poison forest, past the troublesome plant. Observe Dragoni plant and back of the shrine, so I gotta get past the troublesome plant. It reminds me, I saw a strange plant in the back of the forest when Shana took a rest. Oh, the one that became a monster because of the dragon's poison, but you cannot get past it unless you purify it with something. How about the spring water underground? That might help the plant. That's it! Thanks, the boss. Hey, what about shopping? That's all! So I gotta go down to get the water and then back up and then around to go back to the plant and then once I do that I gotta come back through that area to get back here oh boy it's a lot of ringing arounds thought I entered a uh, DeBoss's shop and apparently I went the wrong door what's so good about an underground adventure What's this all about treasure? Once you look for something rare, you're hooked. Of course, I would enjoy it more if there were no near my nasty monsters. What do you think? Why don't you do it too, Dart? Really? I mean, it's a shop, and yet I can't buy anything. 
Once. I don't know how to use any of these. There's got to be a secret in this shop. Don't want to do that. Ah, there we go. What old fashioned armor? Where did he find it? I, I do wonder if there's anything else up top there. I hate, I hate to go back down and up, but... Yeah, I don't see anything else up here. Sweet, we got another soda, so... I mean, there had to have been a secret in that shop. I mean, come on. The boss's antique shop has only weird stuff. I wonder how he gets into business. It's uh, one of the stylish blue door over the bridge. Every time a new store opened, they built an addition to the building, and in the end, it became like a maze. Does it sound like a maze? I'll play hide and seek. It'll be fun. She almost looks like someone. Like, the, the way she looks... Hold on, it's been a while since I played, but yeah, it's been a while since I played, so I had to look it up just to just to verify. Yeah, she looks almost like Ika from Skies of Arcadia Legends, except younger, obviously. Or just Skies of Arcadia. Uh, hi, hon. Want to buy something? What do you got? What you buying? Uh, just all normal items. This is attack all, which is nice. It's individual. Not selling healing breezes. No, just healing pots. Okay, so... I have a lot of these. Yeah, they can be useful, but they're also taking up a lot of inventory space. And I could just build that back up. Um, I do have a lot of these, and again, I think they just take up some inventory space. I don't think I need that many. A mine and body purifiers are very helpful. Individual attacks really aren't. I mean, they can be if you can inflict it on the boss, but getting items that attack all. Oh, so I still have this item. Blocks enemy moves for three turns. What does that mean? Uh, I can probably sell off some bracelets. Five hundred when damaged by yeah, that's a lot. Revise some death with a given probability. Pretty good armor. Uh, I don't really need to buy anything from him. I mean, I, the, the, misclick. I mean, the attack all item sounds good, but nothing really catches my eye. It'd be really nice if I can find an equipment shop. I think it's up top there. Because the blue means uh, items or equipment. Yo, brother, how about some weapons? Weapons, one weapon, step inside. Way up there. We have played. Oh, well, it's kind of like his forge, I guess, right? I put my heart into making these. Yeah, it's kind of like a forge. It is a forge, not kind of. Okay, let's see. Uh, lance, we already have. Cape increases magic attack, which is nice. Oh my gosh. Legend cask. 
Reduces damage due to magical attacks. Look at that. Your magical attack goes up by a monster load. And your magic defense goes up by a monster load. Now, your defense doesn't go up at all. But it looks like helmets don't increase defense. Got another power risk. We don't want to buy those. Uh, automatic addition. Half damage and SP. Does that level up your additions, though? Like, if you use this, can you use this to level up your additions? Because if so, that's why you would want to use this, right? Uh, Phantom Shield reduces damage from all attacks by half. Oh my gosh. Reduces physical damage, reduces magic damage, and makes addition completely successful. So we have the War God Calling and the Ultimate War God. But again, does that level up your additions? Because if so, then this can be incredibly powerful. If not, then it's not. Because if you can use this to level up your additions, then if there's an addition that you can't do, you can use this to then do that addition. Uh, for now though, I think Powerus at 200 gold is the best thing here. Some of these things are so expensive. Uh, the Legend Cask is amazing as well. I mean, just flat out huge bonuses to everything. But of course, we're talking about end game equipment, I assume, because I do not have that much gold. But we did get Paris on our other two characters, so we're gonna be doing more damage now, which is very nice. We're gonna be catching up to Rose in that department. Uh, we also got SLA for Rose, so a little bit more defense. That's good. Um, I go in this building. You're at the Merchant Guild. It's an organization where merchants can gather in Lohan. We, the Merchant Guild, are trying every day to maintain order in Lohan under the guiding principles of neutrality and fairness. And also go down. Hey, you! Hey, class of brother has something you like! Buy this ring, make anyone fall in love with you in five seconds. Guaranteed. Only one million uh, coin. That reminds me, you need somebody to carry the spring water. Let's have a look. Oh, okay. Good that we explored the town. I like how Rose is just sitting back there. She's like, whatever. That's a man, I have a sharp eye. Guaranteed there. Good buys. I want a bottle. I want a bottle to put water in. Do you have any? Sure, sure. This one's herbal and the best quality you can get nowhere else. You can only get at my store for a limited time offer. How much? Hey, surprise! It's super bargain! How about one with so many zero Gs I can't say how many zeros there are? What the heck is in this bottle? Let's look somewhere else, indeed. Hey, where are you going, sonny? Uh, you don't know the deal when you see it. I was just kidding. Don't take me so seriously. How much is the real, how much is the real price, son? Oh well, yeah, it's about 3,000 gold. How about you don't buy it? It's way too expensive. It's too expensive. Even if I didn't buy that gear I just bought, it's way too expensive. Well, I'll give me this guy. How about 2200 gold? 2200 gold. That's still way too much. Oh, I'll go down 1000. Can't you do better than that? Oh, 500G. That's my final offer. I tell you, final offer. Uh, I think you can drop it once more. Oh, you're gonna make me destitute it, boy. Uh, fine, I'm giving it away now. How about 100 gold? Uh. It's just a cup. All the dots. <laughs> I can't wait to get it free! Well, you insist. I'll take it. Thanks. <laughs> Master bargainer. Just say no to everything. I want to start the town. 
Uh, it's always just so I don't. It's only my water. Gotta do some wall hugging here. I want to go back to the hall, but hotel, but how can we get back? It's, I, I got something smelling good there, but. Welcome to the commercial town of Lohan. I heard there are not many good merchants around anymore. Be careful when you shop, we won't take your complaints. I heard some merchants are marking up extremely cheap stuff to very high prices selling. It's really a shame. Yeah. Ran into one. The town is an online town of merchants. We don't favor either Basil or Sindora, at least so we thought. Currently, Marcel Road is blockaded by Sindora. Nobody can come from Basil. Okay, let's go back to the right and check this area. I don't want to finish this town before we uh, stop for the day. Fresh vegetables! It's a bug, can I tell ya? Oh, I got a hole in it. Eggs, eggs, newly laid and still warm. You know, in today's market, the eggs are probably really expensive. Hold on, there was a guy in that I missed. It was over here on the, like, the top right. Marcel Road connects Hoax and Lohan. That has been blockaded by Sindora. It is affecting my sales. Uh, the town's not doing very well. Not having any customers come Basil is a pain in the neck. There are chipmunks for sale. I used to have one when I was little. Chipmunk? You can find every pleasure imaginable here. What you can find in the back of the arena is a palace of leisure. There are lots of games. Why don't you try when you want to take a break? I guarantee it'll be fun. Boink, boink, boink. Have you heard of mini Minitos? They are really merry species, and just looking at them makes us happy. Minitos are merry, funny, and happy species. I didn't even see that chest there. I was just mashing next. Can't talk to the person up top. Oh, sorry, we're not opening it. Drop by later. I want to play the mini games. Looks like they have like pig racing here or something. I must have uh, seen Secret of Evermore. I heard that not many people are participating in the TS Heroes match. Or maybe canceled. You're here to register, aren't you? Hold on a minute. Hey, aren't you ready yet? Just wait, we don't have enough people here. We'll be starting soon. Okay, so it looks like uh, the, a lot of this stuff in this town is for future stuff. The hero match, the festival is strong. I wonder what's gonna happen this year. Yeah, this is setting up something in the future. I'm closed. Every year I look forward to watching the hero competition. Do you mind not talking to me? I'm afraid of some pigs now. Raise the pigs running here with all my heart. Look, this skin looks different, doesn't it? What is with pig racing in video games? I mean, first I do Secret Evermore where there's a pig race, and now I'm doing Legend of Dragoon where there's a pig race. I think I've almost fully explored the town, but I think there may have been an up way to go. I think that just takes us back to where we were. Yeah, and I think I've been to all these places. I think so. Maybe? Yeah, I think we fully explored this town. All right, so what we need to do in the next episode is we need to go back into the Dragon's Den. Uh, we need to work our way... Well, we actually don't need to work our way too far. Uh, we need to work our way coming back. Yeah, so we can go to the Dragon's Den. 
we will just cross over the river and then get to the suspicious plant. Oh, actually, no, that's wrong. We need to drop down to get the holy water first. And then we need to go around to the troublesome plant. Then we need to get the dragoni plant in the shrine area. Then we need to go back through the dragon's den to go back here. So, like I said, a little bit of running around there. But hey, I hope you all have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. Thank you for everything. Much love to you, my friends. And until next time, on the Legendary Dragoon, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.